It is clear that the world is being terrorized. How far do you think the United States should go to protect all of us, its citizens? For example, the president says he believes that a travel ban is part of the answer. What do you say? And by coin toss, we start with Ms. Handel. Thank you. Thank you. I believe it's necessary to do everything we possibly can to protect American interests and particularly American citizens. So in terms of the president's uh, travel uh, proposal, it is a temporary limited halt for six countries that are known to harbor terrorists. I do not, let me be clear, I do not support a religious litmus test, but I do support vetting individuals coming into this country, particularly from those countries. We need to give the Homeland Security team time to evaluate the uh, uh, criteria that they're using for the vetting so that we can make sure that individuals coming into this country are not set on terrorizing our citizens. Mr. Also, Well, we need a strong counterterrorism policy uh, to protect our territory, the territory of our allies from threats that are homegrown and who seek to infiltrate our territory and conduct attacks. We need strong intelligence sharing relationships with our allies. And we need to continue to take it to ISIS in Syria and Iraq, applying U.S. air power in coordination with local partners such as the Kurds with the very limited deployment of U.S. Special Operations Forces. What we should not do uh, is get drawn into uh, a major ground war in Iraq and Syria. We can accomplish our objectives in Iraq and Syria through the use of air power in coordination with those local partners.